So we're going to use the data analysis linear regression for this problem. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to enter the data and highlight it and then use your data tab and the data analysis. So there is a pop-up that's showing up, but the recording won't show the pop-up, but it looks like this. And it'll have the data analysis and it'll have um, the list of options, choose regression. And the next pop-up that you can't see looks like this. And it says regression. And um, it says input Y and X. So um, you're going to highlight your X data, highlight your Y data, and then choose the 95% confidence level and fill in 95 for that one. And then you're going to choose your output range just to click a spot on the Excel file and say OK. And then when you're done, it will look like this. It will paste in a whole bunch of different options, all kinds of analysis of your data. And uh, this is what it looks like when it's completely filled in that little chart before you click OK. And so now what we need from in here is we need our slope of our line. which is going to be our x variable right there. There's the slope. And then the y-intercept is b. And the standard error, there's our standard deviation. And up here is our r-square value. So um, if you want to plot this data, you can highlight your XY data, go to insert, XY scatter, and you can choose the options that you can see the data points or not. Touch the data and add insert trend line, and then choose the options at the bottom that says display equation and display R squared. And there it is. There's your equation of your line, the same as your regression gave you. So y equals 0.0269x, which is the slope of the line, and the y-intercept of 0 0.1912.